Yo, what's up, guys? Welcome back to the channel. And today we are checking out the Fister Comet S2 Cabrio, and uh, it looks really cool. Check it out right here. Uh, it costs $1.8 million, so it's kind of like ridiculously overpriced. But hey, you know what? It says a car so light, fast, and easy to drive, you barely have to lift a finger. Coincidentally, it's also the most popular car for the millionaire under 25. So you can pull up in Vinewood Hills, pull down the roof, watch the sunset, and make more trust fund babies in the passenger seat. That's asset growth right there. So uh, we already bought it. We bought it in pink because like that was the cover car. Uh, I think it looks incredible. I put the regular Comet S2 right next to it, the white one, if you guys didn't know. Uh, this is just the drop top version. Uh, and I think it looks really cool. I like it a lot better. I'm a drop top fan. Obviously, this car looks slick, dog. I mean, Porsche 911 is classic. But I'm a drop top person. So let's go ahead and get inside this car. And uh, unfortunately, it's raining outside, so instead of driving it first, let's just upgrade it and modify it. And hopefully, uh, by the time we spend a ridiculous amount of money, it stops raining outside so we can see how the car drives. And uh, put the top down. You see, look at the weather. Look at the weather, bro. Like, come on. How are you going to drop a convertible car today and then have it rain all day? That's ridiculous. So let's go ahead and get brakes. Let's get armor. Bumpers. Oh, we got tuner. All right, we got retro. That's kind of fine, though. It kind of makes it look like an old car, like an old Porsche. Kind of like that, like, if that's what you want. The rest of these are okay. I'd never like this bumper, even on the regular S2. I think here, though, honestly, the stock one looks dope with the fins. But I might go tuner, just to change it up. That way I don't go stock. Yeah, let's go tuner. 4,600 bucks. Bumper delete. So it just gets rid of, like, the fins. Or it adds fins, really. Uh, oh, wow. Yeah, you should get rid of the whole back or that. So these are a lot of the same options on the regular S2. This looks fine. Let me get that SR spec. Oh, what the heck? Oh, no, I don't like that, like, mustache. It puts, like, an Italian mustache on the back. No tanks. Engine, max it out. Exhaust, performance. Here we go. We got crossover. What's the, what's the crossover? Oh, it just crosses over. So that's if you get the bumper delete. Uh, let's see what else we got. We got race exhaust. Do we have titanium? That's a turbo. There's no titanium ones on this one. Let's go turbo exhaust too then. And fenders. Oh, we can get arch covers. Do we want arch covers though? Like, do we want a wide body on this uh, drop top? I think I'm going to add the fins. I don't think I'm going to go wide body. Uh, you know what? Nah, I'm not doing wide body. I don't like the bolts. I'm just going to add the fins. Hood. Let's go for oh, We can get it secondary. We can get carbon. We can get smooth. We got like a vent there, SR spec. This would match the back bumper. We got SR spec back there. Uh, this one's kind of nice. The vented hood? Not gonna lie. Kinda, okay, I don't like that like nostril, dorsal fin, like blowhole thing. That's kind of ugly. It kind of makes my skin itch too. Uh, you know what, honestly? Honestly, call me basic. Call me a basic Starbucks kid, but like, I think I'm gonna go with the smooth hood. I'm going smooth here. Uh, horn will... Ah, you know what? You know... We'll do it. We'll do it, because, like, why not? Why not? Let's do it. Headlights. Yeah, let's go ahead and throw the Xenon. I don't know if we're going to do neons on this one, though. Black Fister Stripe. Okay, so this adds stripes. Ooh, that's actually pretty clean. Like, if you kept it pink with the black stripes, or you can throw on the Retro Stone Guards. That's what I have on the other one that you guys saw at the beginning. This is clean. This actually matches... Like the whole drop top summer vibe, right? High key, probably gonna go with that. Uh, we got red, like racing flag stripes. We got another black stripe. This is clean too, depending on like what color you make the car. That's nice if you're into like racing decals. And uh, oh, this the whole back of the car on this one is gray. Those are pretty cool. Yeah, you guys know I'm going with that. That is sick. All right, we already have insurance and stuff. Black the plate out, high key. No, let's go with the SA exempt because we're exempt from everything let's go you can get in chrome if you like vibe like that here's our crew color our crew color is a lot further than hot from hot pink than you guys would think and that actually looks kind of fi high key yes we're rocking the crew color actually you know what no no we're not gonna do the crew color what i'm gonna do is i want to get it in white and then i'm gonna put the crew emblem on there no that's kind of it kind of looks weird with the livery there already I would have to give it a delivery. Well, well, we'll just rock with it for now. Let's go. Let's go back to the regular colors, though. What do we have? 
Let's see. What? Oh, you can go with a brown if you're like sophisticated. Oh, the blues look good too. Racing blue. Oh my gosh. In the comments below, what color would you make this car? You guys gotta let me know. What's your favorite color on a car? The yellow. That's hard to say no to. That's so hard to say no to. Even the orange is nice. Reds. Uh, I think I'm okay on the reds on this one. That like dark silver, like, like liquid like silver. This is like that Dodge Charger color right here. That's kind of smooth. High key though, that yellow, it's stuck to me. It's stuck to me. Race yellow. Yes, please. We're going to go with that. Also, pardon like the voice. I think I might be a little sick, but I definitely wanted to pump this out. I like Porsches and they added another one. Let's go for black. Black secondary is what I'm thinking. I wish it was like a carbon option like Forza. Because imagine if you can make the mirrors carbon. I mean, there's probably going to be the option down, uh, down there a little bit. That actually looks really good. Don't yes, sir. Why is black $420? That's hilarious. All right, so is this the whole interior? It is. High key probably should just make this black, right? Let's go back outside. I feel like black is the only color that's going to fit on the inside here. Unless we did like a... Let's see. That's like cream. No, that doesn't work. We can do like a brown. Ah, if we can't change the color of the soft top, I think we should just leave it black. Skirts. All right, we got, we got a couple of skirt options here, actually. Uh, oh, that's clean. The performance skirt. Yes. Yes. Tuner skirt. We got carbon tuner. Do you need a drink? Uh, yes. Yes. I'll take one of those. Uh, splitter. Let's go for. Do we want to put a splitter on this? Like, I feel like splitters are a little excessive sometimes. We'll do a little carbon splitter in the front. Spoiler. All right. We can do a carbon, uh, ducktail. That actually is kind of cool. If you blacked it out or you were going for like a Batman thing, you just get rid of it that's kind of clean does it give you like an automatic spoiler then if it gives you the automatic spoiler that's worth it i don't know if it does though I i'm gonna try it i'm gonna see if it gives you the automatic spoiler that like goes up and down but if it doesn't i'm gonna come back in and put the ducktail on it let's just drop it on the floor absolutely transmission yes sir is it done raining it's like sunset all right let's go turbo and we're just about done uh wheels the wheel stock wheels are kind of cool but like high key you already know we're about the track wheels and the new uh, street wheels. That's nice. Uh, let's go for... Oh. Oh. We just did it on them. High five. That's the one we're going with in black. Yes, sir. Tire designs. Do we want to throw uh, any branding on there? Oh, well, we could put yellow branding on there. That's a little. That's a lot, though. That's a lot. Uh, tire enhancements. Bulletproof for sure. Need that bulletproof. Black. Oh, yeah. And then just tint it out. Oh. I can't tell if it does the front uh, headlights. Oh, no, it doesn't. It looked like it did at first. All right, limo. And I think that's it. That is it. All right, let's exit to ground now. Oh, my gosh. I'm excited to see how this thing drives because I'm a big fan of the regular Comet S2. That, like, is definitely my favorite car from the last DLC. Okay. Goodbye, Captain. All right, let's go. Oh, wow, that's nice. It sounds really good. Hang on. Oh, yeah. And it's not raining anymore. Bet, let's take this bad boy over by the beach. Let's take this bad boy by the beach. It has really good acceleration. The acceleration is shocking me right now. Let's go and turn over here. Hey, don't don't yell at me, dog. Don't yell at me, dog. Don't be mad. They hate us because they ain't us, bro. Let's go. All right, let's not crash it either. Can we get to the beach before sunset is over? Let's see. Let's see, can we get over there? This car was made for the beach. We gotta get it to the west coast, dog. Let's go, come on. I can't tell if I'm going the right way anymore. I might genuinely be lost. No, I know where I'm going. We're almost there. Almost there, come on. This car, as you guys can see though, is amazing so far. And it does give you the automatic wing. I just noticed that. So yeah, dude, if I was you, I would go smooth smooth spoiler on this one get the automatic wing not every car has an automatic wing so you, on the cars that does like that do have it oh my gosh i'm just illiterate now the cars that do have it you gotta enjoy it all right let's go should we cruise down this way oh no let's go jump on the highway i know where to go hang on let's put the top down first top down oh 
Oh, that's a nice mechanic right there. Look at that. Look at that. With the top down. And we're impotent rage. How much more GTA does it get? Top down Porsche, guys. Uh-oh. This car, it handles really well, too. This might, this might be my favorite car in the game now. As a lot of you guys know, my favorite car in the game is the Pegasi Reaper. And it's been that car since it came out. High key, though. Dom, shut up. High key, though. This. I mean, the looks are there. It looks amazing, if you ask me. I mean, like, look at it. It looks phenomenal. The acceleration is good. The top speed, I can't tell yet, but uh, it's not too bad. I would have to drive next to another supercar to tell. And it's a drop top. And it's a yellow Porsche. Like, how? what more do you want? This car is awesome. If I were you, I would buy this car. As you can see, this whole video is a lot longer than it should be. Uh, at, at least a lot longer than my other customization videos. But this car is just like all of that, dog. This car is all of that. Oh my gosh. There's only one way to end it. There's only one way to end it. <laughs>